Hi, my name is Ricky Wynn. I'm one of the application engineers at Hawkridge Systems. And today we're going to be going over a very simple but powerful tool in SolidWorks Composer called Camera Views. It'll allow us to fix up camera orientation issues so that all of our assembly images are all consistent. So here I have a couple of views already done. Right? I have a beginning view as well as step one where the arm begins to turn and then it begins to rotate upwards the camera position changes and then it zooms in to show the clamps closing in. So in this case what I want to do is I want to take a look at step two. Right? I want to go ahead and fix that one and then we'll go ahead and work on creating another view where we have the close-up position but also have the clamps opening up. Right? So we'll have a close-up of it open and closed as well as the camera position of these views here right? where it's open and closed as well. So in step two you can see that the clamp is actually out of position. And what I want to do is take the camera position of step three, right, and that's it. So all I have to do is click on step three, click on the second button to go ahead and create a camera view. Then I go ahead and rename that. So I'll call it step three camera view. Now all I have to do is activate step two, click on step three camera view, and then update it. But then now I realize that step 3 and step 2 are actually redundant. So in step 3, let's go ahead and show the clamps actually closing. Now I can zoom in, right? I can use some of my rotation tools to have the clamps close up. But in this case, what I want to do is I find out that, hey, someone already did this for me already in step 4. So all I have to do is initiate this step 3 camera view to put it in that same camera position. And in this case, I'll go ahead and update step 3. So in step two, I have it open, and step three, I have it closed. So now in step four, right, I'm just getting a zoomed up position of those clamps. Now if I want to go ahead and show up at step five where I have them open, right, I can see in step two that I had already done that. So while I have step four act active, I'll go ahead and create a camera view, right, and a view available in my viewport. I'll go to step four, camera view. Then what I'll do is activate step two, they'll open up, go to step four camera view, and then record that. So you can see in all of this, we're not changing, we're not moving things around, we haven't translated or rotated any of our components, right? We're just seeing where they are now, and then just changing the camera position. So we have step two, step three, and then we also have, in this case, step five, and step four, and so forth. Now, in addition to this, right, you can see that the camera views for step four, you can see this view and this view, the previews are exactly the same. So not only is it the position of your actors, but if I were to activate step five and zoom in a little bit, select these components and make them a different color. In this case, I'll do a black color, right? If I click on step four, you're going to see three things change. The position of my actors will collapse in, right? Will clamp, will close in. The colors will change back to where they were before, right? And also the camera position will also change. Whereas if I activate my step four camera view, if I go ahead and go back to step five, change the colors again, zoom in a little bit. By activating step four camera view, it's only gonna change the camera position. So if I double click on here, you can notice that the colors still stay the same and they still stay in its open position. So in today's video, we covered how to best utilize camera views. The main advantage of using camera views is the ability to have consistency across all your views, as well as limit the amount of rework that you have to do. You incorporate it right in the beginning of your design, implement it after some views have been created, as shown here, or use it to clean up camera positions after all your views have been created. Thanks for watching.